Hi everybody, welcome again in this new video which will be about uh, how to check of output voltage of a Dell battery especially Dells with 9 pins so this battery has nine outputs or nine terminals so how can we check the voltage of the output voltage of this battery yes in some batteries we just uh, measure with multimeter uh, on the lines and plus pins but in some batteries it doesn't work like that like this one let's see for example if we uh, just check the voltage directly on the battery with the multimeter so I have to put this here to make it stable okay so let's fire the multimeter oh, there it is and let's connect it okay so let's check what we'll get on this battery so here is minus and here is plus and it's indicated on the battery here is minus and here is plus Okay. If you don't have like this adapter, you can just use directly uh, small pins, uh, small probes on the terminal, directly on the terminals or on the pins. So let's check. So as you can see here, we have this voltage 5.4.8 and it goes down. So this is not in fact a relevant reading of output of this battery. As you can see here, we got 6, then it goes down. So to read the exact voltage of this output of this battery, we in fact need to uh, uh, make this battery like it's present on a not on a laptop like plugged when this battery is plugged the laptop detects its presence uh, let's let's see what I mean in a schematic uh, give me a minute to find the so dead schematic any dead schematic will do for the explanation let me check so yes here I have find one okay so this is the schematic so let's uh, search for battery connector let's just tape battery as a keyword and let's search so let's scroll on these findings i think here is something that looks like battery connectors we have two of them so we have to check which one we need let's again click on here here so here we have pack p means pack battery two and here we have the battery one so we need this one let's close it here so as i said before the battery should be uh, we should stimulate a battery presence presence in a laptop and here is the
the signal which is respons responsible for that for, for that operation this one p bat which means battery and here p r e s which means present simply so it's pin let's follow the line to sh check which pin is that pin number four so pin number four should be uh, pin number four should be shorted to ground to get the exact reading of this battery so let's just fix so i have to do things like this let's fix this here this probe here so that i my hands will be free for other jobs so as you can see on the hair it's 4.6 and it's going down and it's jumping as you can see let's see now if we short the pin number four this one so one two three four to the ground the ground is the two pins here at the left so let's short pin two for example which is ground with pin number four and pay attention to the reading here on the millimeter so this is the exact output of this battery it's 11.3 and this is not the exact reading so again 11.3 this is how we stimulate the presence of the battery in a board uh, uh, stimulate the presence of the battery in a laptop, uh, or laptop or a board it's the same thing so here it's like as if the battery is plugged and recognized by the system so to be sure of that let's check this battery with the laptop i have a lap working laptop here uh, so that we can check the percentage of this battery yes here is the laptop which i have just repaired and it has a charging issue in fact i didn't manage to record the video uh, i have a problem of recording videos uh, because i am always disturbed by a lot of customers when people are coming uh, every uh, 10 15 minutes so uh, it's really difficult for me to uh, uh, record videos every day i really wish i can do that but so let's check the health of this battery and the percentage so let's and get in bios in fact this battery needs to be replaced it has been uh, uh, worked for two years so now and uh, recently the laptop got uh, the charging issue so uh, here as you can see here it means that the battery should be replaced we have no adapter plugged let's go to so let's go to battery information so here it's it's discharging in fact it's low i see adapter not installed and the percentage i don't know if you can see that but uh, uh, it's uh, uh, yes it's at 38 percent let's close So this is how you can 
check the output of the batteries with nine pins, nine terminals. Uh, if you are asking about these uh, connectors, in fact, these connectors uh, uh, can be uh, ordered separately or uh, with, uh, for example, universal charger or battery testers. Uh, it's available on the internet. So I have, in fact, so many others there, so many tapes, and uh, this is the cable which I use to connect to my power supply. So here, for example, this one is for, for example, it's used uh, for uh, Lenovo batteries, and we have so many other adapters here. So these tools, in fact, are necessary in the repair shop. I have forgot to put this cable. Let's put it back. So I hope that this trick helps you in understanding some things concerning, especially the schematics. So here, if we, you have, for example, a battery presence issue or not detected by your laptop so first thing first is to follow this line to check all what's related to this line especially the first diode if exist the, in this schematic it shows that this diode is not populated on the board and also this one and you just check if you have the 3 volt always on this line and you follow this underline by copying here this term and paste it there and the search so it goes to as you can see here to the micro controller Here you have to check this this uh, related component, this one and the other resistors, this one, this diode, etc. So I hope things are clear and uh, I just like to share this tip with you and see you in the next video bye bye